Welcome everyone. I just want to document this video. Uh, it could be speculation at the moment because um, I have only run this test once uh, with this configuration and so the result could be wrong and I'm okay with that but just in case it is, I'm going to doc. It, it, just in case it isn't, I'm going to document this um, and speculate that it's accurate. So I took a flat battery and uh, have had it on. So we got my circuit plus Tesla's patent. I'll put the number on the screen. Oh, what is it? Three three six nine six two or something like that. I'm gonna put the number on the screen. Um, and my circuit runs very efficiently, as we've seen before. If I disconnect this uh, battery that is charging very rapidly, I might add. Um, yeah. So if I disconnect that. We can see this light here that runs through Earth is currently separated by 60 meters of Earth. Uh, I take the battery off of that. You can see it gets a little bit brighter. Put the battery back on. A little bit dim. So now that's uh, obviously using my circuit, which you've seen before. Um, without this yellow connection here which is coming from the capacitor which is connected to Tesla's patent wirelessly coupled on that same coil that's on top of so it would be L3 um, and that's connected to this capacitor which runs back to the battery uh, as the main primary source to run that light if I disconnect that yellow lead, that light almost entirely extinguishes, but there's just a faint little glow there. My circuit's still running, but we'll put that put that back. And well, actually, while that's off, just show that. The battery stops charging. Oh, well, the battery, yeah, is actually reducing in voltage now. And so, a little bit less on the wattage consumption as well. But the main thing is, is that my circuit is not operating that light through earth and because of that that charging function has stopped so it's almost like a byproduct um, yeah so that's still dropping so that's it's somewhat of a byproduct without this yellow lead my circuits not going to run through that light so we'll put that back on and then at the same time then we'll be able to see the charging going back up rapidly so what I'll do is that's pretty much charged for that battery uh, I'll let it go just over it a little and then I'll drain it and then repeat the process um, so when I started charging using this new connection again schematics at the end uh, it was at 12.75 and so I'm not going to make any claims it is what it is I can't believe I just said that I hate that saying anyway <laughs> it, it is what it is um again schematics please try to replicate and uh, maybe all of us together will be able to work out what's going on a bit quicker here uh 
my back's killing me. I've got to go. See you down. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe. Have a nice day.